Hello, welcome to my channel. So today we are going to discuss um chain of commands uh, task. So as we have discussed previously, what are the steps that is involved in chain of commands? Okay, as I said in the next session, we are going to discuss a task. I mean a task like how uh, that I mean any task that can be achieved using COC. So today we'll just check that part okay so before directly going into the coding part we will first know what is the like a requirement and so that we'll be understanding better and we can do it like easily if you understand the requirement we can uh, easily do it so let's go ahead first i am opening client so this is a client the requirement is under the general under the general tab we have set up button group okay under the general tab we have set and button group and there is a button called print management okay so there is a button called print management now i have to disable this particular um, i mean uh, print management button see every button is enabled so if i click here if i click on this uh, print uh, management button i'll be navigating to some other uh, form okay it should not happen because uh, this print management have to be disabled so this is my requirement let's see see first we'll just check whether it is enabled or disabled so if i click here let's see so it is moving into other form right so it should not happen because our uh, requirement is this form should be disabled right so now i'm just going back so let me go back so i should not do anything so it should be in a disabled mode so let's see how that we can achieve by using chain of commands okay let's see. so whenever we are opening form only we should get it right like uh, whenever we are going to open this particular form we have to like this button have to be in a disabled mode so what we can do is we can write the code in a init method because init method calls when you are opening a form Okay, you can write it directly in our init method as we are going to extend init method from the when table form. So let's check whether it is a when table form or not. Okay, so let's uh, like right click anywhere in the form. Okay, right click here. So form information as you are able to see it's a when table form only. Okay, so as we have extended when table form only. so that we can uh, like you have to check whether uh, which form it is exactly now you have to write a uh, print management right so first we'll open when table and let's see form extensions i think i have already when table okay so let's uh, double click on this form you'll be able to see when table Uh, let's wait it's taking some time to open okay so what is that print management right so in which tab we have you can check in this way it is in general tab right in general tab so let's see what's the control name so print management let's uh, right click on it Control name is print management. Okay. Print management button, right? So let's go to the properties. Copy this name. Okay, wait. Copy this name and just check. Um. see here auto declaration to no basically if you want to like uh, you know if you wanted to access this particular button you have to have like auto declaration to yes but also we can achieve it let's see how we can achieve it okay let's see i have already copied this print management button name and 
am pasting here dot sometimes you will not able to see intelligence okay dot enabled so what is the form name when the table right so sorry table name dot blocked okay so let's see whether we are going to achieve this particular task or not after saving just build it So let's wait for a couple of minutes uh, so that uh, it will take some time to build. So build is completed right so let's check now uh, going to the client and refresh this form and we'll just check whether this print management is disabled or not okay so let's refresh in this way So, uh, are you able to see print management so print management is disabled because as we have uh, like uh, used here we have written cvoc to disable that particular button and and as you have seen that this is auto declaration to no if it is auto declaration to no also we have like used this particular button so print management button and we have like disable that particular button okay so in this way that you can write chain of command for any particular task thanks for your time bye subscribe for more